Welcome to our channel. It was a bright, sunshiny day, and Agnes was having a toy sale. She wanted to sell off some of her old toys that she didn't like quite as much anymore because she wanted to buy a brand new unicorn, one that looked kind of like this. And she was selling her toys, or at least she was trying to, because no one had come up to buy any of her toys. So she was just standing there. She had just finished painting her sign that said, Toys for Sale. And then up came a minion. He said, doot, 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 doot. And he says, Ow. And she said, Hi, would you like to buy a toy? And he said, Ow. And she said, This little guy is cute. He is so cute, but I don't know what he's saying. So she said, Would you like to buy a toy? And he said, Ow. And she said, I'm trying to sell my toys because I would like to be able to buy a brand new unicorn that I could ride and have fun with and play with so much. I saw one at the store and it was so cool. And he said, Adam. And she said, I don't know how to explain this any clearer. And then he seemed to understand. He goes, Adam. and then he scooted off. And she goes, I wonder where that little guy with the glasses went. He seemed very nice, but I didn't quite understand what he was saying. But then he came back. He goes, Anna. And she goes, oh, you have the unicorn I want. Did you buy the last one? And he goes, uh-huh. And she goes, oh, I think he gets it. And she said, but I wanted that unicorn. Why did you buy the last unicorn? And he goes, Anna. And she goes, oh, is it for me? And he said, uh-huh. She said, oh, that's very nice. You can have all of my toys because I was going to sell them to be able to afford to buy the unicorn. And he just said, for you, for you. And she goes, what? You mean I don't have to give you all my old toys? Even my plane? Do you like my plane? You can have the plane. And he looked at it. He said, okay. And so they traded. He took her plane. And he went back to see Gru. And she was very happy because she finally had her very own stuffed unicorn. She said, he's fluffy and I love him. And he has a horn on his head. He's so cute. And he's got pink hair too. And look, his head moves. And he's just so much fun. And so she said, you know what? Because he was so nice, I'm going to be nice to other people too. If anybody comes up and decides they want to buy one of my toys, I'll let them have it for free. Because I was willing to give them up to be able to get my toy, my toy unicorn. Maybe I didn't want the other toys as much as I thought I might have. So what this story means is you should always be generous to other people and be giving and kind. Because let's face it, our little minion was very kind. He didn't even expect to get anything. When he came, he accepted the, the plane because that was a nice thing to do. And he had fun playing with it. And as a matter of fact, when he came back, they played unicorns and planes all day long. So here is the toy set that we used in our fun little story. It's the Agnes Toy Sale Minion Set. It's from Mega Constructs. And of course, it's inspired by Despicable Me 3. So we actually uh, we actually picked this up on sale, but we were super excited to get to show it to you guys today. And we're going to unbox it and show you what it looks like coming out of the box. So we're going to open up the lid, reach down in here and get the little figures. See, we've got Agnes and... On the horse. Yeah, we've got Agnes and a minion and her pony, her pony unicorn. So we're going to go ahead and pop them out. So here is... The unicorn and his head I moves. Want to hold the unicorn. Well, you can hold the unicorn here in a bit, but we gotta finish getting them all unboxed. So there's the unicorn. He's really cute. Like I said, his head moves in a pretty good number of ways. He's really cute. We're gonna set him right there. And now let's get out the minion. I can don't I remember which one? minion this is. Well, you can hold him in a minute. And his arms move. And of course, his head doesn't move, but his goggles do come off. He looks. A little weird without his goggles, but his goggles are there. And so we're going to set him up like that. And uh, his feet do move a little bit, so, so you can make him tilt in different ways. But here's what he looks like from the back. 
He's very cute. So we're going to set him right here. Let's move this guy. His eyes move too. Yeah. And then we've got Agnes. And of course, this, like I said, this is, comes from uh, Mega Construct. So it's kind of like um, Legos. It's not technically Lego brand, but you can you should be able to play with this with your Lego set, though. There's Agnes. We're going to set her up. Of course, her legs and arms do move, and her head moves a little bit, too. Let's see what else we've got in the box. What? Whoa. Uh -huh. I got your Always fun to get out. Always fun. All right, we're going to actually open it from the bottom so we can get them out from the bottom. Oh, I want to play with them. I want to play with them. Can I play with them? Well, we're going to play with them here in just a minute. Okay, so we're going to open up the bottom of the box here. And then we get the rest of the pieces. So we got lots of small pieces, so this is not recommended for kids under three. And then the here's the pieces. sale sign. We saw that in the video. And then, of course, we've got the instructions as well. So you can see I how to put all this together. I got some more pieces, too. Yeah, you got some more pieces? Okay. So this is what all we have. We got all the pieces here. There's not a ton of pieces. There's a little over 70 pieces all together. So you can see what all you have here. And so we're going to put it together so you can see how that is done. You have to watch out for the camera. 